<laughs> Welcome back. It's National Milk Day. So MasterChef Legends winner Kelsey Murphy is here to help us celebrate in style. Kelsey, I know you brought all kinds of options yeah, here. I'm really excited about this. I didn't know it was <laughs> National milk? milk Day. I didn't even know that was a thing. I guess it's a thing. It's January It's national whatever you want to make it day. Yeah. So all the yeah. time. I mean, who knows? There was like National Earring Day. I don't know. Yeah. There's always so, something. There's something. I'm glad um, we're doing this, though, because I actually sometimes get conflicted about what milk to use. I absolutely yep. do. And um, I figured it was best to kind of clear the air on all of it. Yeah. You go okay. to the store, and it is like overwhelming. Yeah. It is. The amount sure. of like real estate there is in milk yeah. mm -hmm. um, <laughs> and lot. so are you guys dairy drinkers are you not dairy drinkers uh, or I'll, I've kind of switched over to like an odor and almost like, switched I, over I yeah. really I do dairy but I don't always drink milk okay right yeah. and I feel like a lot of adults have switched like, a lot of adults don't like drink glasses of milk anymore sure. it's more yeah. kids and stuff or yeah. we'll enjoy it in cereal or when we're cooking okay right so um so let's start let's start with our dairy products yeah um so we've got regular whole milk and we've got skim milk and then there's the two in between the two and the one the only difference in those two is the fat percentage. Okay. So that's okay. the, the only difference um, in that. And so when we're really talking about um, is it best to drink whole milk, is it best to drink skim milk, you really want to pay attention to if you need those fats or if you don't need those fats. Okay. Um, because in the whole milk, you're going to get those good omega-3s. Yep. Yeah. The only problem is it does have quite a bit of saturated fat, which we don't love. It's not heart healthy. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, but it is great, obviously, for our littles. Yeah. Um, the American yeah. Academy of Pediatrics used to recommend switching our kids after the age of two to down to a um, low-fat milk. Okay. okay. That Recent studies have been now done that say kids who drink full-fat milk actually end up having lower BMIs. Oh, okay. and less health problems later oh, on. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. So it might be a good option to keep your kids. Yeah. That's interesting. Kids on this. Okay. So good proteins in both of these, cool. high amounts of calcium. They are great, great options if your stomach can handle sure. dairy. Sure, right, yeah. Yes. And, and a lot of people can't, which is why we've got these other Yes, which is why we milks. have these other milks to deal with any dietary concerns, um, if you're vegan, just any diet choices. So yeah. not even necessarily if you can't handle the dairy. So here we have now our almond, oat, Flax, there's cashew milk, oh, wow. there's um, soy milk, there's hemp seed milk, oh, yeah. there's banana milk, I mean, wow. you uh, name it. Kinds. Yeah, there's all, all kinds. kinds of milk. And so Oops. let's kind of go into a little bit about these. So yeah. a lot really popular is almond milk. Yep. Yeah. Um, the only, the issue that we have with almond milk is it really serves almost no nutritional value. Mm. Uh. Um, it does have high amounts of calcium, but there's not really a bunch of fat. There's no protein. Okay. Um, there's it's kind really of sugar water. It it's just like. sugar it's water. Sugar it's very water. just like sugar water. Yeah. I've yeah. heard that more lately. Yeah. So it really doesn't serve a ton of purpose. Okay. Um, oat milk, same thing. Barely any protein. So huh. if you're looking That's for what something I drink with, yeah, yeah. with protein, Ugh. you are gonna get some good like monounsaturated fats in here. So okay. some good healthy fats. Yeah. But other than that. You're getting pretty uh, some good carbohydrates. Okay, that's about it. <laughs> and well, and I try it. and froth it when I make lattes, and yeah. it just depends on the brand. Sometimes it doesn't froth well. Yeah, it doesn't froth well. Yeah. Um, so it doesn't. These two don't really act like regular milk. Yeah. Okay. So they're yeah. not really good cooking options. Yeah. Um, they're just good if you like to dilute your coffees yeah, and like. Sure. I mean, if you need a plant-based option and you like these, yeah. go for it. Tell you got about thirty seconds. Oh, okay. Left. Let's talk oh, about yeah. So this one. Yeah. This is flax milk. Okay. And this is like the best option. Yeah. Wait, really? Plant based. Okay, yes, then I might switch milk. over then. Good protein, tons of calcium, con tons of good vitamins, enough good fats. Ooh, good yes, and it acts just like milk mm. when you're cooking. Okay, it smells so good. So you can use it just as you would when you're cooking. It has a little nutty flavor to yeah. it. Yeah. It might Do take like a little it? adjusting. Uh, I don't like it. Oh, that's just me. I prefer the oat. Well, now I want to know. But it smells good. It, it smells to me. It smells better than it tastes. It will taste. Any of these will take adjusting. But to. I like the oat. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they're gonna take adjusting too. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I, like. Yeah, I would, I would need some adjusting. I mean, oh, you would need some adjusting yeah. to it, it's but if you're looking taste. for yes, if you're looking for nutritional value yeah. or something yes. to cook with, something to cook with. This exactly. is the best option okay. because it acts like milk. It it's will froth. Mm. It will do all the things. It has eight grams of protein, Great. tons of nutritional value yeah. to it. Yeah, um, I probably have to warm up to it. Yeah, yeah. you got to warm up to it. Yeah. Well, Kelsey, where can people follow along with you? So yeah, chefkelseymurphy.com, um, Instagram, and all your social media yeah. at chefkelseymurphy, um, and then come see me at Inspo in the Fisher's Test Kitchen. Um, yeah, that's yeah. I'm all over Indy. We Thank love having you, you on. We Thanks always so learn much. from you too. I know. This is very educational. I learned a lot today. I did Thank learn you. a lot. And yeah. in fact, I do want to start trying this more. Just so try thank it. you. Your, yes. your palate will adjust to it. Yeah. I promise. You will adjust. Thank you so much. Hey, we got Kelsey <laughs> Thanks, Murphy's Kelsey. info right there if you want to check out a restaurant and all of that. Silicon, we're going to introduce you to a local 
fortune teller Ooh. after the break. We're going to ask her where you can find her around town as well. We're back with Molly Burkett from Divine Junk right after this. Stick around, friends. Future.